the Center for Accountability and Transparency has called for an investigation into matrix oil importation of blended coal oil, alleging violation of international sanctions on Russia oil. Speaking at a press conference, Governor Oku Adan claimed matrix oil action have caused economic sabotage, environmental pollution, and health risks to Nigerians. The group alleged that matrix oil imported adulterated petroleum products from Mata resulting in $2.8 billion bill for Nigeria in 2023 alone. We, at the Center for Accountability and Transparency, Transparency, urge Matrix Energy Limited and the CEO to toe the path of honor and give up the detailed list of his collaborators and their modus operandi instead of bluffing with litigation and trying to guard the press. Not even the military junta of old were able to repress every vibrant Nigerian press, not any of them. Since we have seen that Matrix Energy Limited and its accomplices, including those in NNPCL, are recalcitrant and unwilling to stop their economic sabotage, the Center for Accountability and Transparency is calling on the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission to arrest and prosecute every one of those that have committed the acts, the heinous act of economic sabotage and violated the international sanctions imposed on the crude oil of Russian origin. We further invite the Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Commission to investigate Matrix Energy Limited since the dirty fuel it distributed in the country has caused them, has caused harm to consumers in different forms, including economic losses occasioned by damaged automobiles and generators. The National Environmental Standards and Regulations Enforcement Agency, NETRE, must similarly look into the impact of these tainted oil products on the environment to cause the cessation of further importation of such to make the culprit behind it face relevant punishments. Finally, gentlemen of the press, we all the prize cap coalition comprising the G7, the European Union and Australia to activate targeted sanctions against Matrix Energy Limited and all its officials and accomplices for violating the sanctions against Russia. You will agree with me, gentlemen of the press, that it is, this is the right thing to do. Thank you very much and welcome to the program.